Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Prism Baseball. Three box, random team break number three. Everyone gets a random team in baseball. There's also an early bird special. So if you're one of the first 20 players, or 20 players, 20 people in this break, you get a shot at an extra spot right here. So this is a different dice roll. Let's roll it, randomize it. All right, random.org, protect yourselves. And there we go, Snake Eyes here at the 37 minute mark. One and two. Name on top, Jonathan. Fresquez with the early bird spot. John, the early bird catches the worm. There you go, man. Thanks for getting in. Let's copy all those names and now let's assign you a random team. Let's roll it, randomize it. Four and a five, nine times for each list. One, two, three. And ninth and final time. After nine, we've got Gary down to Jonathan in that early bird spot. Let's use a new tab right here. Nine times for the teams. One, two. Ninth and final time. After nine, we've got the Padres down to the Angels. Um, you mean the Hit Parade football, Chris? That has one hit per box. We don't have Hit Parade basketball. Unless it was just added to the site while I was doing this randomizer. All right. Gary with the Padres, Ryan with the Rays, Matthew with my Dodgers. Ryan with the A's, Jonathan with the Mariners, Matt with the Tigers, Michael with the Indians, Rick with the Braves, Oliver with the Marlins, Charles with the Reds, Matt with the Brew Crew, Richard with the Yankees, Luke Ryan, Last Bot Mojo Star, next to your name, Mets, Nancy with the Phillies, Tamara with the Blue Jays, Ryan with the White Sox, Jonathan with the Giants, Matt Medlin with the Red Sox, Charles with the Rockies, Mike with the uh, Diamondbacks, Matt with the Rangers, Nicholas with the Astros, Lee with the Pirates, Brian with the Royals, Michael with the Cardinals, Brian with the Cubs, Matt with the Twins, Allen with the Nationals, Ryan Redman with the O's, and Jonathan, your early bird spot, Angels. Oh, is there prison? Is there basketball on the site? Basketball, I don't know. Should say in the description. All right, any trades? And I brought three random boxes right here. No trades, maybe. Maybe no trades. All right, TWC means trade window closed. Let's print, let's rip. Mark these RT so you know they're all from the same case. So we're looking for three autographs per box on average, Tiger Stripe parallels, ultra rare gems inserts, so all sorts of fun stuff. Final printout. is right there. Three box, random team three. Oh, there is basketball on the site? Mike Towers saying, all right. There you go. Thanks, Mike.
All right, good luck. Shanjin Ru Blue. And our first autograph behind Danny is going to be Mike Fulton Nevitz for the Braves. That'll be for Rick Thomas. And there is the Danny Mendick to 175. That'll be for the White Sox. It's going to be for Ryan Redmond. Tony Gonsolin. So the reds and blues not numbered, so I'm going to breeze by those. The snakeskin is numbered. That's Lance Lynn to 50. And that'll be for the Rangers. That's going to be for Matt Matt G. There's Jesus Lazardo for the A's. Kettle Marte to 60. Uh, Illumination, Arizona, Mike Fries. There's an autograph behind that gold Xander Bogarts. Instant impact, 6 out of 10. And the auto is Jonathan Loisega, New York Yankees. That'll be for Richard Miller. Xander Bogarts. Uh, that goes to Matt Medlin and the Red Sox. Sorry, Raphael Devers. There we go. He's eager to show himself there out of 100. That'll be for the Red Sox. That's going to go to Matt. And the third autograph is... Nick Madrigal, nice. He's a pretty good prospect for the White Sox. There he is. And that will be for Ryan Redman with the White Sox. Redman, White Sox. We got... Algadan Morajon to 125, Lime Green. The Padre, I believe, yep. He goes to uh, Gary Prescott and the Friars. Second box, good luck. BBC America has a, a few good men are getting to the iconic scene. Danger, grave danger. Labor Day. 
And it's Willie Castro for the Tigers. That's going to be for Matt Medlin. 99 out of 99. And Richard Miller with the Yankees gets the Glaber Day, 004 out of 149. Shohei Otani to 125, numbers game to 125 for the Halos. That'll be for Jonathan. Can't handle it, Tom Cruise. And Joey Bart, another nice prospect autograph for the Giants. That will be for Jonathan. Ryan H., did, did we get that zebra hit? I know we had a snakeskin hit. Shinsu Chu, these blues are numbered. That's to 175. You want me on the on that wall. You need me. Yes, Monty Grandall. And we got an Aaron Judge to 175. Stargazing. Nice. That will be for Richard Miller. And there's Logan Allen. Logan Allen autographed for Michael Armstrong and the Tribe. Ah, Stephen Michael. Mustaine saying, I hit the Gio Orshella zebra in the select the other night. There you go. Oh, I think Prism is Tigers, right? Yeah, Prism is Tiger. Tiger Stripe Parallels. What's going on? I did my job. I'd do it again. Of your bias. Oh, the commercials. I like when Jack Nicholson gets all incensed. What's going on? What is this? I did my job. I'll do it again. I'm going back to Cuba. I'm going back to Guantanamo. Yeah, Sean Mercer, maybe more than a few times. Tyrone Taylor to 99. <laughs> I've probably watched this dozens of times. I have a DVD version of it, a Amazon Prime version of it, so I can watch it anywhere I want to. Man, got a lot. A lot, a lot of hours logged in with a few good men. At one point, I was jokingly considering doing a few good men one-man show, complete with a piece of bacon to represent Kevin Bacon in this movie as well and he would play the other the prosecution in this situation. Yeah. I don't know. The the pacing of the movie is really nice. It's uh it's easy to fall asleep to, especially when you've seen it so many times. At that point then it becomes a good like, hey, I'm gonna put this on and fall asleep to a movie kind of movie. Except for when Jack Nicholson yells at the end. That kind of wakes you up. Mike Tower saying, after Nicholson wrapped shooting, Kevin Pollock sat in and ran lines for Nicholson off camera, for off camera work. Sure did. Actually, Nicholson, after he wrapped, he actually was there for an extra day, for the rest of that day. I think for another eight hours or something like that and he just he did he did those lines to get the reaction shots of the other of the other characters and he said that he did it the same way every time with that same intensity I think for some pickups days afterwards Mike Tower 
they did, uh, Kevin Pollack did run lines as well. And, um, and he was doing those lines, and when, I forget the director, someone famous, but when he was doing, when he was editing, at, at one point, Rob Reiner, I think, at one point, they said it took him a, oh yeah, Mike Tyron said the exact same thing. I know my Few Good Men trivia. There's TJ Zook, yeah, it took Rob Reiner a few takes to realize that it wasn't Jack doing it. For the reaction shots. TJ Zook going to the Blue Jays, that will be for Tamara. My Tower, there's also a great pen story, a Kevin Pollack, Tom Cruise pen story that's worth looking up on YouTube after you watch Jaspies, of course. No, it's a short video. You can, you can check it out. Instant Impact to 125, Juan Soto. We've got the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, Will Smith. That is his walk-up music, folks. At least it was last year. There's Rafael Devers to 175. We got Goldschmidt, that checkerboard pattern to 75. Next autograph is Reynaldo Lopez, Chicago White Sox. That goes to Ryan Redman. Redman with the White Sox. Already seen that one, Mike Tower. BBC interviewing Matt Damon about his first scene with Malkovich. He has shared that story a number of times about how Malkovich was such a was such like an indie movie god coming in. They couldn't believe they got Malkovich for rounders. And how, uh, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty good. It's worth looking up, ladies and gentlemen. Pay that man his money. <laughs> he beat me straight up. Oh, he does the, that's the TV version. He says a lot of curse words in the movie versions. Manny Machado, Padres, Gary. He beat me straight up. Pay that man his money. Kyle Lewis, Seattle Mariners, Jonathan with that one, not numbered. Oh, they allow that word, huh? All right, out of 149, Liam Hendricks. And that is that, my friends. That was a quick little three box random team break of Prism Baseball. The final three boxes of this case should be in the store. So check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. We can finish off the case. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.